spaceships, lasers, lightsabers, robots, and holograms. You come. The Star Wars universe seems completely out of this world. But is it? Here are five Star Wars technologies that actually do exist. Laser guns. While handheld laser weapons like Han Solo's blaster and these turrets on the Millennium Falcon may be way off, the US Navy is actually developing a laser weapon to hit drones with one prototype already operational aboard the USS Ponce. However, you may be disappointed to learn that the laser doesn't emit any beam of visible light. You only know it is working when you see the targets burn up. The trials have proved successful, and the Navy plans to deploy the weapon across its fleet by the year 2020. Brain-controlled prosthetics. Luke's prosthetic hand looks cool, but could it actually be real? Well, engineers at John Hopkins University have developed a robotic arm that can receive commands from the human nervous system. The arm has 26 joints and can curl up to 45 pounds. There are now 10 functioning robotic arms of this type that have been built. And a message to the fathers out there, if you're thinking about cutting off your son's hand or arm, you might want to reconsider. These things come with a whopping price tag of $500,000. Hovercraft. Like the idea of Luke's speeder? Well, hovercraft have actually existed since the 1950s. The vehicles work by blowing compressed air out of an air cushion under the craft. This allows it to hover above the ground. Hovercraft are all-terrain vehicles with the ability to travel across sand, mud, snow, or even water. Hovercrafts have both civilian and military uses. Large hovercraft carrying hundreds of people and cars used to run services across the English Channel. Small craft have been used for racing, and the British and US militaries have both used hovercraft in combat zones, including Iraq. Androids. Your favorite android, C-3PO, a protocol droid designed to serve human beings fluent in six million forms of communication. Nothing like that could exist, right? Well, no. And good riddance. The dude is freaking annoying. Shut him up or shut him down. Oh. Well, I don't think smoking is grown up at all. But Hiroshi Ishiguro at Osaka University in Japan has been developing robots for over 20 years, and his results are both lifelike and disturbing at the same time. What's this one called? C Creepio? All right then, yeah, I know, that was a, a bad joke. Back to the script. It may not be six million forms of communication, but this droid can recite any news report gathered from around the world in a variety of languages 24 hours per day. Holograms. Since Princess Leia first appeared as a hologram projected by R2-D2 in Star Wars, people have been asking if they could have a similar technology. Well, this is now becoming a reality. Holograms shot to the headlines in 2012 when a holographic Tupac Shakur appeared alongside Dr. Dre and Snoop Dogg at Coachella. Or was it a hologram? Isn't Tupac still alive? He faked his own death, right? Machiavelli? Back to the script, man! Oh, uh, yeah, right. Okay. So, this type of holographic technology is becoming increasingly mainstream. So, it turns out most of the stuff from Star Wars is real. At least the Force is just some mystical hocus-pocus. the Force around you! Oh, yeah, I guess something like that might be real too.